Hey guys, this is Gaurav. Welcome to SaaS with ServiceNow. In this video, I will show you how to submit an incident in ServiceNow. In order to create an incident in ServiceNow, you need to go to Incident Application. Under Incident Application, you will see a module called Create New. Click on Create New. It will open up a new form which will have number, caller, and short description where you, you can fill all these fields and some other fields. This number will be automatically be populated once ticket will be created. So you can see as of now, caller and short descriptions are mandatory field. So if I will try to submit this incident, I will not be able to do that. So let's try that. I click on submit. It will give me a message, an error message called following mandatory fields are not filled in. And that is short description and caller. In order to proceed with submission of this ticket, I will put the caller. So as of now, I can put my name because I am ITIL user as of now. I can put the category of the incident, what kind of category it is, so what kind of issue I'm reporting, what, what is the category of that incident. So maybe it's a software issue. Then I can select the subcategory. So maybe my email is not working. Then I can select the business services. I can put IT services. And then we have configuration item. So let's see if we have something with email. Okay, we have email business services and we can also select it as configuration item. Then we have contact type. Maybe uh, I have been contacted or, or I am I am putting this incident on behalf of someone and he called me. So maybe I can just put like phone. State will be the same. We will not touch a state. Then we have impact and urgency. Now this is uh, if the impact is really high, then you can define here. So if it's high, low, medium. So I think my email is not working or it's or maybe the complete team's email is not working. So if it's a really high impact. So as of now, we will we will think, OK, uh, one team is not able to send email, maybe. So we will put medium urgency. Yeah, definitely. So we have some business impact and uh, and, and and we do have some urgency. So we will put medium again. So priority will be moderate here. And now you saw that it automatically got changed because you cannot change the priority. So priority is dependent on urgency and impact. Then you have assignment group. So if you know what will be the assignment group, you can go to service desk for now. And uh, if you know somebody from service desk, you can also mention his name here. But as of now, you can leave it blank. Then you have to put the description, short description. So you can mention uh, database team email is not working and then we have description here you can explain the issue that what exactly you you are getting the issue so for example you can you can mention uh, since uh, morning today whole DBA team is not able to send or receive emails and then you can see this is called related search results so this search results it's totally dependent on the short description of your incident so you can see it found some uh, KB articles with database keyword. So uh, whatever sort description you will put here, it will automatically try to search some related articles. Uh, then you can click on save. Once you will click on save, this incident will be saved. And now you have seen it assigned one number to this incident and that is 10007 so it's inc 001007 this is the incident number for this incident and this has been assigned to service desk uh, let's let's see if it is it sent any kind of email communication and this has been assigned to service desk so this is how you submit an incident so thanks for watching my video have a great day